was home. Yeah, Seth Smith was a Consumnus Oaks graduate with deep local ties. Today, his mother shares who Seth was ahead of tonight's vigil, which is one day before what would have been his 20th birthday. Courtney is standing by with more. Yes, we have uh, Michelle Rody Smith, Seth's mother, with us this morning. Michelle, thank you so much for spending your time with us today. I can't imagine the strength that it takes for you to chat with us and share some of who Seth was and is still to your family ahead of his birthday tomorrow. Good morning. Good morning. Thank you very much for having me. Oh, absolutely. absolutely. And, and you, you sent us some wonderful pictures of Seth. Uh, as we mentioned, uh, he went to high school in Elk Grove uh, at Casamas Oaks, Oaks, correct? Yes, yes, he did. All right, and uh, tell us about some of his favorite things. I understand he really loves drama. Oh, gosh, he has loved theater since he was a little boy. Um, and then he got involved in theater, sorry, at Pinkerton Middle School with, okay. Christi yeah, with Christine Chun Moslin, who then was also the drama teacher at Kasubnis Oaks, and he just transitioned right into that. He yeah. uh, was involved in many things. He did the Linnea activities with Mr. Bob Cooner. He did um, the improv activities there. He was involved in every musical and fall play. He did everything from Shakespeare to, you know, My Fair Lady. He just really loved theater, loved going to the theater. My husband works for music service. So every summer we would see every play and every musical since he was a child. And just that was, that was a love of his, absolutely. And you can see it through these pictures. You can also see uh, his humor as yes. well. What a fun, fun young man. Now, I have to ask you about this. Uh, he had a double major at he Berkeley. Did. He did. And it was interesting. Most people asked if he was going to major in theater or in culinary. He was an amazing cook and loved good food. Really? And, yes. And learned how to cook from his gram and his auntie and just was a, he cooked everything for us. So I'm going to, you know, go hungry after a while. Um, yeah. Yeah. So. Um, I'm sure he picked up a few things, though. Maybe yeah, looking over his shoulder. Few. I can do a few, um, yeah. but yeah, his majors were economics and history, which shocked me a little bit when he said economics and I asked him why, and he said, because, oh, sorry, um, it's the study of how humans interact and behave with each other, and he saw mm -hmm. it as a way, as a medium to which uh, he could work on the world and work on relationships between people and try to make it a better place to be. I think that is a wonderful sentiment and just a wonderful testament of you and your husband raising such a wonderful young man. I do believe that his spirit is still with us. I think that he will still continue to affect the community, especially the people that he has touched personally. And I just thank you so much for your time this morning. I know that you and your family are doing a, a special vigil for him tonight. And again, uh, his birthday would have been tomorrow, his 20th yes. birthday, right? He would have turned 20 tomorrow. And actually the vigil tonight is not organized by his family at all. Tonight's organized by the Kasumnas Oaks Theater Community, as well oh, as awesome. other, yeah, as well as other Kasumnas Oaks students he knew. He touched a lot of people in positive ways, and so they really wanted to um, have a time to remember him. We're doing a separate service next week. Okay. Well, Michelle, thank you so much for your time again, and thank you for sharing. Thank you. We thank you. Appreciate it's it. important that I get his name out there and keep it out there because. We have no leads as to who would kill my son. He was not hurtful to anyone. He did nothing. In fact, the Berkeley PD has clearly stated he was simply walking and was shot in the back of the head. So we just really would like answers. So if anybody knows anything, I would love for them to come forward. Absolutely. Thank you, Michelle. We Thank appreciate you. So much. you. Thank you, All Courtney. Right.